Sit down. Don't touch him. No, I don't touch. <laughs> That's naughty elves. Well, we got truth in stuff. That's naughty. Put that down. Chica. It's like they writing something, but they haven't. What is these trouble? It's like it's wet. It's been wet. It's only old. I think they're having a snowball fight. Oh, yeah, like oh, the elves. <laughs> Now leave the snowballs there, darling. Leave the snowballs there. <laughs> Come and look what the elves have done. They've been having snowballs in the living room. What do you think? Should we have snowball fights in the living room? Probably don't look very impressed. Yeah! Very nice, she's just got up. What the elves and tree? What do you think, son? What do you Oops, think? watch the tree. That's what you think. Be careful. Sticking your back, won't they, darling? Oh. Oh. You've even got a little forest there as well, haven't there? Hey. Eh? Oh, don't touch that. That's a sleigh. That's how they get here. That's a sleigh. They've robbed that, haven't they? Yeah, they robbed it off Santa Claus. How are they going to get? going to get here with his presents if the elves have robbed the sleigh? Um, they've got to come back to the North Pole and give it back to them. Oh, maybe he might. Rain in his right there. I think Santa needs a roof on that now, don't he? He must get wet if it rains on Christmas Eve. He has a hat on. Yeah, but he'd still get wet, won't it? Yeah. Unless he's got like a Santa umbrella. Do you think? No. Because down, on Christmas down. Eve, when he starts coming, he loves the rain. He just keeps him going. Mm. Saying that, I suppose he could drive really fast for it. Pass the rain over the hill to get to the houses. Put mm. these mules. Hey, right, give me that now. Thank you. I'll put it back. All right, thanks. Okay, mummy will move the elves, and then you can play with peppers in the snow, and they can play snowball fights. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> right, so uh, Mummy will put the elves away, okay? Here's we'll get this one. one. Here's another one, Put them in here. Sit them all in here. Get another one. Sit him there. Oh, they're bringing the snowballs with them. God, I think they're going to need a bigger slave to come next year. Is that many of them? Hey! Only... <laughs> Excuse me! <laughs> oh, I'll have to just pile on! <laughs> this one can't see, poor thing. Never mind. And Aurora's just decided to throw the snow all over the floor because she's so cheeky. <laughs> so we're just gonna, change. we've just been tidying up, haven't we? Get ready for nursery. We're just gonna do your hair now because she looks like she's just woke up. But we're just piling all this snow together, aren't we? Yeah, with all these snowballs. And the trees. Yeah, we're gonna put the trees in like this. Wow. In this one. Look at them. Look. Should we do Pepper and George a little photo shoot? What? Put that one at the back because that's a big one. Yeah. That's a big Christmas tree, yeah, and then we'll put these here and then we'll show the guys 
picture we got of them all together. Yeah? Is this Pepper getting in? Don't mess it up. I won't be able to get a nice picture. All right, let's stand them together. Let's move that tree around there. I want this one. Yeah? And this. Let's move them like that. And this. Oh. Tell you what, should we take that one out and just put all your new ones in? Yeah? Oh, these ones in, put these ones right. in. Right, put them there. Right, put us on the tree back up. Right, get Mummy's phone and we'll take a nice picture of him. Yeah? It? It's over there. Okay, we're just going to take a picture of him. Oh, they're having jelly babies as well. Why don't you eat that? Yeah. Hold it a minute. Let's take a picture first. Yeah, let's show the guys. Right, we need to, hold on. We're not even in the right mode. Which one do we need to be on? Right, let's put it, this might be too close actually. Let's get it on this one. Come on round here. Come round here and have a look. Tell me if you think it looks good. I can. You can? Quick. I can. Come and have a look. Look I at the peppers can. in the photo shoot. Look. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Look. Quick, come and show William. Mason, Mason's coming. Come and show him. Quick. Look. Oh, look at that. Look, the peppers are having a photo shoot. Tell him peppers are having a photo shoot. <laughs> Get closer. Let's zoom in. Yeah. Whoa. Come round here. There we go. Are they having jelly babies as well? Yeah. <laughs> right, move that way. Let me get a nice picture for you. Come round here. Fine. Got this one right here. Oh, look. Look at these pictures. Wow, look. They had a photo shoot. Do you think they look good? Oh, I think that's Daddy. Should we go and let Daddy in? Then we can go nursery. Yeah. Okay. Bye, everybody. See you later. Good morning guys and welcome to today's vlog. If you wonder what I'm laughing at, Dave thought it was really hilarious to put a toilet roll tissue on his eye like he was peeking through the door. Seriously, he's woke up in one of them moves today. Anyway, we're just going to nick out for a in nursery. Just started editing last night's vlog. Or tonight's vlog. Well, it'll be last night's vlog by the time you see this vlog. So, most of that is done and it should, fingers crossed, the Wi-Fi in my house has been absolutely shocking. When I say shocking, we were putting vlogs up, starting them off at like five, and they're still not going on until like six in the next morning. Anyway, I'm gonna get in the car, I'm freezing, I'm gonna go shopping. So yeah, let's go. Okay guys, we was gonna take you shopping, but we ended up going shopping and, well, we only went for like a couple of things that we needed for Santa, um, but we didn't have anything. So, there was not really much point in taking me around because we can't show you what we're getting because then that would give things away. So, anyway, we came home. We did get a couple of things for baby, but we can't show you them. Maybe at a late date we can. Uh, <laughs> and, yeah. Anyway, I'm just at the minute, currently, Sorry, but I just feel like in this camera, my makeup just looks so blotchy. Does it look blotchy to you? Mm. Hey. Blotchy? Yeah, does my makeup look like it's like white in spots? I don't know whether it's just the camera, but this here, I think this is like a rash underneath the skin. Anyway, as you can see, I've got a cold sore. Well, it's not cold sore, it's just a sore lip and it's swollen. Um, so, I'm just getting the filler because, as you know, the windowsill is, well, the back of it's lifted. And we've put so many um, repairs in and they're doing nothing about it. So, I'm going to do it myself and hopefully it'll keep some of the draft out because the cold coming from that window is ridiculous. So, anyway, let's get it sorted, see if we can do something with it. And then carry on with the rest of the day. Oh, in fact, quickly. I've got some, I, put, I keep saying I'm going to show you the tree outside and we'll show you the tree outside in a bit. I want to show you really when it's a little bit darker just because it's lit up and you can see how nice it looks. But just, well, Dave picked these up. It's 50 battery powered string lights. Um, these are more coloured. I have got green and blue on it. I'm going to leave them on, I think, and just add these as well. But yeah, we'll see how it looks. And I really need to try and find a couple of bottles. But I just want plastic ones so they don't weather and they'll be okay outside. Maybe just something cheap, just in case they do ruin and then they can just go in the bin and be replaced next year. But hopefully, if we buy something and it's weatherproof, I suppose I could paint them with like a gloss so they, they are weathered and they don't ruin. Anyway, I'm just going to crack on with this. Um, it's cracking on a little bit in the afternoon now. It's 10 past 2. There's a couple of things I need to do around the house. Lots of washing out, ironing and stuff like that. So, yeah, let's come and do it. Okay. 
Okay, so I managed to get most of it filled. I've ended up having to use one of these. I'm going to get Dave to pick another one up on my own so I can finish this side. Um, I was going to use this, but the handle is actually bent. I don't know whether we've stood on it or whether it's got caught behind something. So this is going to have to go in the bin. I think here I've got a spare one at the studio, so if we have, we can always bring it home. I thought it was there, but I just can't find... I just can't remember what I've done with it or where I've put it. But we've had this for years, like literally we've had this since me and Dave got together, I think. So it's well and truly, you know, done its jobs. So well and truly do an upgrade or a new one. Even though we'd all love for there not to be any housework to do. But unfortunately in this house, there is plenty. You can already feel the difference. Like the cold air from the side has gone. There's a tiny bit here just because there's a bit of a gap here. You can feel a tiny bit, but I don't know if that's coming from the window actually. Um, and then obviously over there, but the window over there actually isn't as bad. It was more this corner. I just need to do that very end corner later on. So, but yes, the, the joys of having to do the DIY that somebody else should be doing. Welcome to Sarah's messy kitchen. We're gonna clean up, we're gonna tidy this kitchen again. Well, for, I'll say about an hour, then when Dave comes in, we'll be back to normal. So, I think I'm gonna ban him from the kitchen. Maybe that is the best idea. And yeah, anyway, this kitchen needs a deep clean. The tall strass sections that pulls out, they need cleaning. They've not been done for a couple of weeks. Um, and not because they don't clean up, just because I couldn't be bothered. So, I'm going to do that today as well. So let's go and clean and make this kitchen look like, oh god, I can't even cope. Look, this is ridiculous. Look at the state of it. Like, you just cannot live in a kitchen like this. It's horrible. I actually feel like I just never clean up. I do clean up, obviously, you've seen before when I clean up, but I've just been trying to get loads of stuff done. After coming back from shopping this morning and literally not had five minutes. But, in about ten minutes, it will look like a nice kitchen again. dishwasher i'm going to clean all of the back of this but i have cleaned the toaster as you've seen but i don't know how this toaster gets so many crumbs in it i mean that's only a couple of weeks can you imagine if somebody left it a month i suppose there is a lot of us and we're always having quite a lot of toast i've lit my first candle where it is burning away so i don't know where to put this in the living room i'll leave it there can't make my mind up so i think after christmas i don't know if i told you we've seen some tiles that we really like i think we're going to go gray um so we're going to change them after christmas hopefully depending on whether we ended up staying here we've not we're not 100 percent sure of what we're going to do yet frank is definitely coming out this week to put the shelves in here this bag needs to go to the studio it's got some gloves in it and some yankee jars we're going to do some craft stuff with the yankee jars i want to start hiring them out for weddings if we get time before christmas then we will do that if not then it will probably be just after christmas and that will probably be on the simple sarah channel so keep a look out for that i'm just going to clean this up now because i've dropped some snow out of one of these snow packets and then all these are going back to the studio okay i thought i'd just come out and show you the tree um we put this on but i'm just going to show you now with the light on and then i'll show you quickly with the light off i'm not sure whether it's going to zoom in but this is it lit up how cute does it look
we're back now with the advent calendars with the kids and we are on day seven today. So the girls are gonna start, then we're gonna go over to the boys, Oscar. Alfie's got a little bit of toothache, so I don't know if he's gonna be able to last or not, so we'll see in a minute. Yeah, go last. I'm not bothered. Is this day seven? Yeah. Wow! Yeah. Pepper goes camping. I can't wait to read that one with you. No, the enjoyment's taking the door off, isn't it, darling? So we need number seven now and here. Number seven. Where seven? is number seven? Next to the bells. Hey! I wonder who we've got today. A train. You got a choo-choo train. Wow! Let me see. You got a choo-choo train for George. Yay! You got a wow. So another solid toy again. This is like a choo-choo train this time, which is where it focuses. Really good. It's just a solid red train, but they all count, I think. Come on. Oh, the boys. Come on, Oscar. Then we'll get Porsche. You feeling all right now? No. I don't think Oscar's get, Alfie's going to last. That uh, way. Door seven you're on, you know. Oh, no, you're on four, aren't you? You do one every other day. Salt and vinegar. So well, Alfie's got a bit of toothache and Melp is giving him a cuddle. Bless him. Porsche's turn. Colour is it, Bosch? Green. Does it not smell nice? No, oh, that smells like re that smells like primary school soap. Christmas. Wow, remember the remember the soap you used to get in primary school that was um, that was white and no matter how many times you wash your hands with it, it was still there. When you started school in eighty six it was still there in ninety four. The same block. Look, we're getting these are getting really good. Now we've got quite a collection. There is another present somewhere which is a yellow present, so she's getting quite a lot. <laughs> now it's the revolution one. Not vanilla piece, I've always had sorry. Lipstick. Lipstick. Yeah, lipstick. She got a little lipstick, babe. She got one lipstick. What colour is it? Oh, that's a rouge. Is it the same as you have one? They're two complete different colours. Red colour. Is it red? Oh, my top. Can I have your lip? You want a goalie? You do it in You want a goalie? Why? You can't even tell. Yeah. You do, she uses the tip instead well, don't of the Well, don't worry about it, you're going to put it on your lips, right. aren't you? So? Come on, door, door seven for you, right at the top. Bubble mesh! Oh, what? Marble mesh. Wow, let me have a look. Oh, yeah, so the marble goes up and down like this. That's what she got today. Oh, yeah. Are you happy? Yeah. Brilliant, fantastic. So, day eight tomorrow, hopefully Alfie will be better in the morning and he'll be able to show you his before yeah. they go to school. All right, so we're back now with the advent calendars, me and Sarah. She's got the beauty one to open tonight and the Yankee candle one. What number are you on? So, well, whatever number you did last time, any of those have you opened? Oh, I keep, I keep thinking that it's No, six, it doesn't, it goes up to 12, that one. So you skip a day. Yeah. Sorry. So you'll be on. Four. Yeah, I was just about to say then, famous last words, an easy door to open, but it is ne nothing's ever easy with these cheap ones. Do you want me to open it for you? I swear that. Well, you may as well, it's a shit calendar. I've seen it all now. Look at the state of that. I know, it's not, it won't, it won't even. What is it? A clip. A clip, an air grip. You have to do the rest it's of the video. It's pretty strong that, you know. I've never seen one of them in a beauty one. I thought that was for your eyebrows. That's a feel how good it is. Is it metal? Yeah. It's, really it's metal. It's really strong. Like, it's not like, it don't feel cheap. So, got to give him that. Might be a shit calendar, but the pro at least the products are proving to be good. So, you know, it's not about packaging. <laughs> Let's go to the next one. This is door seven. Oh, I think this is the one that I can smell. Look, it's, like it's dropped that. I like an egg box inside, isn't it? I can't get it out because it's, you see, I've got a push it that way. Smells nice. Mm. It's a pregnancy thing. Alright, but the Lego Star Wars one, it's got to be a figure today. I think. What do you think? Mm, yeah, definitely. Yeah. I might get it right today. We've got it if it's not. It's not, it's the speeder that picks up the Mandalorian. 
Uh, what, what, Joel? Result. It's never usually more than two, is it? No, so it's the speed that, that picks him up. I don't know what Max is doing behind there, but you look like got a tail coming out your ear. Right, I'll build it quick and we'll come back. <laughs> Alright, so I had to check what the speeder was because I know it's the one from The Mandalorian, but the character's called Mithril. So it's the guy at the beginning of The Mandalorian when he puts him in the speeder and then he goes to the Razor Crest. But this is actually pretty cool. Um, I was a bit confused with the front end that had, you know, this rounded big piece at the end. Yeah. In the instructions, it doesn't show you where that goes. So you, like, to, at, the end of it, yeah, but at the end of it, you're thinking, like, where's the round bit supposed to go? Mm -hmm. But I worked it out because it had to go on these wedge pieces at the end. But it looks pretty good. Yep. Um, this is the sixth. Let's have a zoom in. Yep. This is the sixth mini build to one figure. Well, that's pretty high, that Nix, from all the other ones that we've had. Mm. We've normally done like three days, maximum four. Then you get a mini figure. Yeah. How so, many mini figures are in well, it? I've looked on, I've looked on it, and I've found one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So there's about seven mini figures, but they'll probably put a mini figure in there that's not on the, the, box, the box like a surprise one and a, a build that's not on the box but yeah you actually get a speeder which i'm surprised about you look at the box you've had one of them in another one though haven't you not in um a, not in what i don't know you know i think you have well it's unusual for you to get a speeder and a speeder biker i haven't actually got a speeder biker at all so i'm well chuffed that i'm getting a speeder biker but i haven't got one but yeah you get the mandalorian in his christmas jumper and you get baby yoga in his christmas jumper and you get the christmas version of the cop Mm. So yeah, so um, hopefully tomorrow we'll get a minifigure. You know, we should have got one of them and sent one to your Graham. You message me, um, I could get one for the boys. You message me, um, can send him. I know, that's what I mean, there. like we couldn't get him, but. Um, and I said, he said, um, I really wish I'd have got one. Every year I kick myself and I don't get one, so we'll try and get him one next year. Because I know he'd really like one, you know, for the builds. Yeah, and definitely get the boys one next year. Get theirs before you get yours. Uh, what I think we'll do next year is you can order them <laughs> off the Lego website. You can pre-order them. So when they come out, you just pay the price for them. And then when they're released, send them you. Yeah. Like October, I think they come out. So at least you've got them then. But these are well worth the money. When you think about them, 20 quid, you get 24 Lego kits. Some of the minifigures, like this year, like I said there. Is it usually more than that though? Because you got yours on offer, didn't 24 you? 24 99 normally, but it's 20 quid. It's weird. The Star Wars ones are 25. The Harry Potter Lego Friends and the um, Lego City ones are 20 quid. Maybe it's because they pay more for the license for Star Wars, but they're the two. Like last year, it wasn't really, um, it was the Darth Vader, I think, but it was like a Christmassy one, but it wasn't like really super limited edition. These are because it's it's printed on his torso and also with Baby Yoda as well, so that's what you And will that, that's the first one they've done on Mandalorian as well, isn't it? I've gotten absolutely no Mandalorian sets. At all, so well, it's not yeah. been out that long, has it? So, no, they did the Razor Crest this in the new series out now. Ne new Boba Fett's Christmas book of Boba Fett's out unboxing day. Mandalorian season three's out next year. Have you watched season one and two? Well, you've watched them all, you want to watch them again. Sarah really liked them. Yeah, if anybody's not watched it, definitely yeah. go and watch it. She's not a massive Star Wars fan. <laughs> no. she likes Rogue One. We went to see Rogue One in the cinema. Do you know what that. kept me going because I wanted to see what was going on with the child. <laughs> Child, I wonder if he'll come back because Luke took him, didn't he? Yeah. No spoiler alerts because it's been out too long, so we will um, check back in tomorrow. <laughs>